You are watching Cooking with Derek. Check this out. It's July 4th, hanging with friends, family. So I'm gonna say, it's a beautiful day to be grilling in Tennessee, Nashville, baby. Anyhow, show you a little Tennessee love on this grill. I am the grill master and this is what I do. So, when I'm cooking my ribs, what I like to do, just a little tip, is put all your charcoal at the back of the grill and then you, you put uh, your ribs towards the front. But what that allows you to do is it allows that your it allows your uh, ribs to cook in indirect heat. Um, and then as far as the uh, other stuff, you can just put it directly on there. So one the, another thing I like to do as far as when I'm cooking ribs or anything, you know that the ribs are done when they begin to fall off the bone and the bone begins to break apart. Uh, obviously, you know you can use a thermometer but it was like a cool thing. Like they're not done yet because they're not breaking. Like I should be able to fold this slab like this and, it sh and the ribs should break. So uh, that's another quick little tip. But anyhow, man, enjoy your 4th of July. Thank you for all the veterans that's out there fighting for our freedom. And uh, I'll let y'all later.